Hey everyone, it's Will with ManufacturedHomes.com. Welcome back to Where's Will's Manufactured Home Tours and thank you for your continued support by clicking on this video. Today, I'm out here in Grand Island, Nebraska, taking a look at this beautiful modular right in front of us. This is known as the Bella Vista Sycamore, built by Bonavilla. Now this home is a three bed, two bath and it sits at 2136 square feet it's got a 512 pitch roof a beautiful little patio there on the side of the home and there's your door just imagine building a garage on a home just like this i love the dormers i'm loving the way this home looks on the exterior the elevation is absolutely gorgeous and just to let you know the price of this home starts at three hundred and twelve thousand dollars let's go take a home tour Where's Will? Welcome to this gorgeous home, everyone. As you can see, just walking in, there's a lot to look at. You know, we landed right into the foyer here, and as I shut the door, I'm going to be spinning around here, taking a look. Look at that, that entertainment center we're going to talk about in a minute. But let's come around here and see the foyer section. You have a nice little entryway that you can do a lot with. And by the way, there's a little den that comes with this home that we're going to go walk right on into and take a look. The stand you can make a you know you can turn it into a lot of different things. Personally, I would make it an office, but that beautiful big box window right there that that is absolutely gorgeous. This is enough ample room for a den, a game area. Like I said, personally, an office, plenty of light right there, and the way it is just right off the door. I like that, I like that a lot. So let's go ahead and we're going to open up this door right here and take a look at the air conditioning unit of course that's where this one is situated in the home easily accessible if you have any issues or you just want to clean out the uh, the filter right there easy easy and then behind this door in the den is your basement access now the one thing about this home is there's a few different options that you can do with your basement access you can change some of the floor plans there's a hidden pantry feature and so forth but if you want to know more about that there's a link in the description below click on that that's where you know you can see some more photos some more videos take a 3d tour and most importantly get that pricing directly from a retailer near you and then of course in the foyer here we also have a nice coat closet with a wooden rod and a wooden shelf now that is nice um, we're going to spin around we're going to take a look at this gorgeous home here you can see the beams in the living room that is a nice decorated touch um, I, I love the tray ceiling there it comes with that uh, ceiling fan and like I said this uh, entertainment center here this is looking nice I love the wood accent to it um, there's options that you can change make it your own um, it comes with nice six floating shelves that's nice little cupboards there so you know if you have gaming systems and whatnot you can have it hidden all your cords straight through the wall which makes it way convenient and as we spin around here we're gonna see this um, this counter it's kind of like a uh, you know a breakfast uh, a counter um, you know and some more shelves right there for storage so you know it's nice the size of this living room by the way is 20 feet 5 inches by 17 feet 10 inches that is a huge living room more than ample space I think for for a lot of families in the world so that's really cool and now you know we're walking into the kitchen here and this kitchen is another huge huge space um, one thing about Bonavilla the appliances do come with the home okay but the way they have it for the air for their model homes is they send them out and you have your option of you know your white black um, silver or I mean, stainless steel excuse me or omit them but they do come with them so just to kind of clear some of that up but this kitchen it is huge right now I'm standing in the morning room spinning around to take a look at the outside um, see a beautiful porch beautiful porch now just like I said earlier imagine a, a garage right there that just opens up your 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 backyard that is nice the morning room size or the dining room size is seven feet nine inches by 13 feet 11 inches really big really big nice um, can lighting everywhere great ex accent lights as well plenty plenty of cabinet space cupboard space and drawer space and um, here in the pantry we have another room that gives you plenty of space 
for all of your home goods, all of your cans, all of your your, your cereal boxes, you know. Um, and like I said, there's where the, the refrigerator will go. Nice subway, white subway towel behind. I do like the color uh, scheme of the uh, cupboards and the, uh, the counters, that's nice. Um, soft clothes drawers and drawers. Good quality construction, I can tell you that right now. Nice, the way they feel, everything is heavy in the Bonavilla homes. And what I mean by heavy is big, heavy drawers. Uh, I mean, excuse me, doors. You know, big, nice drawers, good cabinets, just good quality construction uh, behind this drywall here. So, and now, you know, we're gonna take a look and the cooking area in the prep space, huge, huge. I mean, literally, I can completely see myself just rolling out the dough on that island, you know, and, 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 you know, spinning over for the ingredients here. We have our 60-40 uh, um, sink right there with a nice uh, faucet. Again, the construction, we're gonna take a look over here real quick, this corner. Nice, plenty of space. As you can see right there, you might have a little, a few dust bunnies there. But like I said, nice white uh, subway towel all, all around. We have our, our um, corner drawer there. The only thing that's missing is the Lazy Susan because that makes life a little easier there. See, there you go. It's the same thing with your range hood. You know, they have options that you choose from in the ordering process. So uh, that's how that works. Pretty nice, looking good. We're gonna walk over here and take a look at the utility room, laundry room, mud room, whatever you guys call it. And another space that just has, has, has more than ample space for a lot that you need. We have a nice little window there, let that light in. And then behind this door here, we're gonna take a look at it in a minute. <laughs> but first, there's the uh, entire utility room. Plenty of space for your side-by-sides, your electrical panel. And now we're gonna spin around and take a look what's behind this door. And yes, there is your hot water. Easy, easy to get to. Um, I believe this is a 40 gallon um, that comes with this home, so that's really nice. And then behind this one, we have a half bath. So, this is a two and a half bath technically so there's that I believe that is also an option that you can keep or omit but it's a nice little touch especially you know when you're on this side of the house you don't have to run to the other side but really nice good lighting textured drywall complete tape and texture in this home it's really cool really nice this is a beautiful modular Now, as we slowly mosey our way to the other side of the house to take a look at the guest rooms and the master, if you haven't had a chance to subscribe, do, do me a favor. Subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell. That way you'll always be alerted to when a new home tour is posted. You'll be able to catch up to where I'm at because sometimes I don't even know where I'm going. So we just have fun with our home tours. So click on that and follow along. And now, you know, we're going to go into our first guest room right here. The size of this guest room right here is 12 feet nine inches by 10 feet five inches that is a nice sized guest room again even uh even the uh, closet doors are nice and heavy and well put together they're not those hollow doors you know um and in here we have a nice little uh, rod and wooden shelf to go along with the home i'm thoroughly impressed so far with the house i'm not sure if i've mentioned it or not yet but uh these are nine feet sidewalls with a flat roof nine feet so you have some high ceilings it's really nice really spacious makes it even feel even bigger than it already is so i mean because i mean, look at that mirror look at that i love that um what do you guys think about that let me know in the comments below the size of this bedroom 11 feet by 11 feet 7 inches comparable to the other side a touch smaller but quite comparable okay let's take a look at in this closet here nice plenty of room plenty of room good construction you know they're not even chintzing in in the uh in the closet sometimes you know in some homes you'll have board and bat and and stuff in the closets but nope this home all the way through it's amazing um, I'm loving it so far. I hope you guys are enjoying the home tour. Let me know. Let me know. And now we are going to keep going through and we're going to check out the other guest bath. 
Now this gas bath here, it's separate. You have your your single vanity right there with your uh, your mirror and a couple drawers right there, three to be exact. But it's separate from your uh, from your other area, your shower area and your toilet. That's kind of nice. You can shut people out if you know if somebody needs to get ready in the morning. That's nice. But with the home like this, you could use that half bath all the way across the other way if you're in a hurry. So and then we are in the uh, other half of this uh, this restroom here. And it is a standard 30 by 60 tub, um, nice shower head that comes along with this home, looking nice. Um, I'm liking the architecture in this home, uh, the lines, the, the cuts, it's not just cut and dry, you know, big box. Um, they've given this home some life, so I'm um, quite impressed. And now we're going into the primary room, everybody, and this room right here is 14 feet 2 inches by 16 feet 9 inches. It also has that big box bay window, which is nice. This, um, the uh, sliding barn door is an option, so that uh, can be completely omitted if you like, but that's what that looks like right there. And now we're going to go into the primary bath and take a glance. Now in here there's a couple different uh, options that you can choose from so hit that link in the description if you'd like to see those. We have a nice a single vanity on this side, one mirror, um, three drawers, uh, soft clothes, nice. Nice little backsplash there with the tile. Look at that soaker tub, that's nice. And this is kind of like a double-sided uh, restroom, you know, um, so it makes it a little easier if, if you are getting ready as a couple at the same time, you know, you're on the each side. Um, and like I said, a beautiful, huge soaker tub right there in the corner. It's kind of like your own little just, just corner there, you know, um, you just sit there and enjoy it. And then we have the uh, closets here we're going to take a glance at in a moment, but spinning around, you don't also, you don't only have the soaker tub, but you have a nice tiled shower in this home, um, right in the middle there, looking good, looking great. As you can see on the right hand side, that is where your toilet is behind the door, which I always personally love. Um, I don't like the, uh, the toilets just being so close to like, you know, um, tubs. I don't know. That's just me. How about you? Taking a look now, we're going to open up this door and see the size that we have. It is a nice size uh, closet. Good construction, wooden uh, shelves, carpeted. Um, the uh, vents in this home, you know, as you can see in there, it's on the floor. But uh, mainly, uh, you know, I've seen the vents kind of everywhere. Um, it's in the floor, in the walls, mainly in the walls in a home like this because of where it's at. This is up in Nebraska, so, you know, it's a little colder during the, the winter, so it's made for that temperature. And that's the cool thing about manufactured housing, you know, being modular or manufactured, these homes are built to your area where you live. You know, if you're in a high wind area, you're in a high snow area, that home is built for you. So that's really cool. Um, but that is a great, you know, big primary, you know, area. And this is actually a nice big home. Um, actually, it's creeping up to one of my top fives. I'll tell you what, I like this home. I like the feel of it. I hope you guys liked it too. Let me know what you thought of it in the comments below. Um, and if you'd like to see anything, you know, let me know. Um, thank you for joining me, everybody. I hope to see you again uh, next time, wherever I'm going to end up. But of course, in the meantime, I hope you have wonderful days. You live smarter and choose manufactured and you travel easy.